breaking news at 10. It is all hands on deck in Philadelphia's Port Richmond neighborhood for a four alarm fire. Our CBS3 traffic camera captured in the distance a roaring inferno. Good evening, I'm Jill Holden. The blaze so large, fire crews are warning of possible power outages and flying embers in the area. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Patrol is live at the scene. Let's get out to you, Matt, right now and give us the latest on this firefight. Well, this is dangerous both in this area and around it because so many roads are closed because there were just so many hoses in the middle of the street. And right now it smells of thick smoke in the air from this fire. If you take a look behind me, you can see those flames are still shooting into the sky some three hours since this fire started. Investigators tell us that this is happening at a warehouse called the Thrifty Irishman. That's on East Butler Street, not far from Frankfurt Avenue. I'll take another live look at the smoke billowing into the air. Officials tell us they're not sure what started the fire. They don't even know what is powering these massive flames, but firefighters are still battling it right now. We were told, though, just moments ago that the fire has been under control. That happened around 950 tonight. Now, officials say the fire started just after 715. It can still be seen from miles away. Uh, you can see flames just shooting into the sky. Philadelphia's fire commissioner tells us the flames were so aggressive tonight. It made it especially dangerous for his firefighters. They started to make uh, an aggressive interior attack, which is always what we do, and the volume of fire quickly uh, changed that uh, tactic, and they were uh, pushed out of the building, and we quickly had to mount uh, an exterior attack, a defensive operation, as the fire spread from essentially one side of the building fairly quickly uh, to the other side of the building where it's still burning. And this is just one of about a dozen hoses just trying to douse flames right now up above. I don't know if you can hear that, but there's a helicopter overhead. It has an infrared camera that's pinpointing the hottest parts of the fire, just as uh, they're just trying to douse uh, all those flames. We're also told that more than 150 firefighters and other workers are on scene tonight, and they're expected to stay here throughout the night. Reporting live by Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. A busy night for the Philadelphia Fire Department. Matt, thank you for that live report. Right now,